able to uh, walk tonight? We're rolling. Yes, you're going to be able to walk tonight. All right, guys, we've got our, our friend Porcupine here who's got some foot trouble. Porcupine, you okay if we video your procedure for all our friends on YouTube and around the world? Yes. How long have your feet been bothering you, bud? About six months. Now, I noticed that you had some inserts in your shoes, so this isn't a brand new kind of issue for you, is it? No. All right. Uh, and in the past, have you had to have injections? No. You've done the orthotics? Mm -hmm. All right. And usually that gets you pretty good pain relief, 100% pain relief, or just partial? Partial. All right. So what we're going to shoot for now is uh, getting you complete pain relief because this is really bothering you. You also wear some uh, heavy boot type work shoes. Mm -hmm. Okay. So when you wear those, do you wear the inserts as well? Yes. All right. So that's probably helping. I'm really going to recommend, and I don't like to use brands and stuff like that when I make a video, but in this particular case, I will. The Dr. Scholl's gel inserts seem to really do a good job uh, helping people with this, okay? With the plantar fasciitis. So next thing we're gonna do is we wanna find our spots that we're gonna inject. So you got tough feet, my friend. <laughs> I'm on them. <laughs> Dimple didn't show up very well. All right, so right in here is the first one. I'm gonna actually draw a circle. And the other one I believe was right there. Oil and gas. That's right. <laughs> and this one's gonna be right in this area. So no other places. We're just going to hit those three? Mm-hmm. All right. You may want to sterilize that pen. I do, please. So what we're going to do is we're going to inject you with some cortisone, a little bit of lidocaine. We're going to use a little bit of numbing medicine and uh, see if we can't get this feeling a whole lot better real fast. Now, usually when we do these injections, it feels pretty good for a few hours and the pain kind of comes back in a little bit later in the day. Uh, but that's okay. It doesn't mean we didn't get it in the right place. It just means that it uh, needs a setup overnight before it really works. So we have two different shots for you, two different needles. Now I'm going to tell you, i got to be honest, Mr. Porcupine, this is going to hurt, buddy. Okay? Mm -hmm. So we're going to have Gummy Jean spray the cold spray on you, and then I'm going to put a needle in there, and we're going to inject the medicine. Which we're going to do with the left foot first. Okay. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, take a deep breath. Blow it out. Give me a little bit more on there, would you? Little stick, here it comes. You can holler if you need to. Man, he's tough. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I, I didn't mean to laugh. That actually, I know it hurts. I was laughing at your reaction. All right, that's one down. I told you it hurt, didn't I? <laughs> did you, I didn't lie, did I? <laughs> He was trying to hold off. <laughs> Put me back in the oil and gas. <laughs> I know they hurt. I know they really do hurt. I've never had to have this injection, but I've given lots and lots of them. I've had some injections before, though, so I know what people people go through. So we're going to go ahead and go right here first. All right, you ready to do the second one? You say when. Okay. Here we go. little stick. You're good. Good, 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 good. Deep breath, deep breath. That's all you're going to get there. We're going to do the other side over here. There you go, a little stick. Here it goes. Take a deep breath, bud. You're doing fantastic. Almost done. Almost, <coughs> almost done. Now right. you are done. Scale of 110, how much pain was that? I never had a baby. Off the scale? You never had a baby. <laughs> Pretty bad. I told you it was tough. I told, I told you it was going to hurt. All right, at least we're truth in advertising here. And if there was any way I could make this not hurt so much, I promise you I would do it. But the only good thing about it is, is the pain is, is like lightning terrible, and then it, then it sort of stops immediately. So they shouldn't be hurting at all right now. <laughs> yeah, right. They are, are. are they hurting a little bit still? Yeah. Well, all right. Did you put the met? Did you put water in those shots? No, I did the. You did, I did, I did, you did the good stuff. Of the one yeah. percent plain yeah. and okay. then one cinnamon. Okay. So you got a total of two cc's of triam cinnamon, uh, one in each foot, and you got some other some lidocaine, and that's the numbing medicine that we hope is going to work for you here pretty quick. Mm -hmm. So hopefully you'll be able to walk out of here okay. Now go get those Dr. Shows, Dr. Scholl's gel inserts. Mm -hmm. Wear them, use them. Uh, go ahead and use those orthotics that you've got for your shoes with the Dr. Scholl's. If you can put them in together, you're going to be better off. Definitely use those gel inserts with your work boots though, okay? Okay. And no matter what, you know, try not to walk around outside barefoot and try not to wear uh, you know, flip-flop sandal kind of things because they don't provide enough cushion for your heels either. Okay. 
I'll tell you what, Porcupine, we're going to give you a gold star for being brave. <laughs> he did all right. He he held his expletives to a minimum, he did. Jim. He really did. He did good. Yeah. Thanks again for letting us share your procedure with our friends on YouTube. Bye, guys. For the Meta 7 video. Give us, uh, give us, you've been on Meta 7 for how long now? Um, about a month and a half. Month and a half. All right. Tell us what you think. Uh, I like it, man. It's really great. I noticed uh, a few things. I was surprised. Uh, I, I have a lot more energy in the mornings mm -hmm. uh, and throughout the day. Where before I would, I would have a little bit of energy in the mornings, but I would just get tired out yeah. throughout the day. And uh, now I know I have a lot more energy uh, through the whole day and uh, a lot more clarity. You don't get that afternoon brain fog. No, I don't either. I, I don't. I used to. You don't get the urge to take an afternoon nap either, do you? No. And before, yeah, come 2 o'clock, I used to get tired, man. 2.30, you know, yeah. I, I would get tired. And now my energy lasts all day. Right. You know, uh, a big difference in it. Do you find yourself doing stuff in the evenings when you get home? Yeah. I find myself doing a household chores more. Uh, before, I'd just get home and call it a day. Right. And now I could go out and I'll do yard work. So you tell them the truth. Yes. Yes. Uh, <laughs> I, would, I, I, am. I, would go, I would go do yard work or I'll take the dog, you know, for a walk around the block where before when I got I home, evolved. that was it, you know. When I first got on it, I didn't realize how much it was going to help me either. And, and the darling wife started coming out into the barn at, you know, 9 o'clock at night saying, are you even going to eat supper? Because I would just come home and I would just hit it running. And, oh, yeah. Yeah. And, and, and I think my sleep, and I was telling her, I think I, I sleep better. I don't know if it's because I'm doing more during the day. So, you know, and so at night I, I sleep better before, you know, it wasn't like that. Awesome, man. Hey, thanks for sharing with us. I appreciate it.